Oh, hello, and welcome to Nerd Today's Decay. Celebrating births and beginnings of everything important since the dawn of time. May 6th edition. And what did happen today, you ask? Aha! <laughs> I have the answer for you. 16... No! 1868! Hello, dyslexia. <laughs> uh, 1868 today, Gaston LaRue was born. The author of none other than the Phantom of the Opera. Right, and here is a original 1925 photoplay novelization with the tie-in dust jacket to the Lon Chaney Sr. film. It's also got stills <coughs> uh, throughout, so that way you can take the Phantom home with you and not just uh, leave him in a dark and movie theater. I was able to go see the Phantom of the Opera on Broadway uh, February 14th, actually, shortly before it closed for good. And uh, I loved it, I gotta say. Um, growing up in New York, I can't believe I never saw it before. I think just the whole idea of Broadway, to me, just caters to, like, idiot tourists and no thanks. So this has got to be, like, the dumbest of the dumb. But it wasn't at all. Uh, excellently choreographed. Great illusions and like stage stuff going on the music's utterly over the top and in times feels like completely inappropriate um like dario argento mid 80s type atmosphere or something like that i think i'm selling it to you because you know you can't go anymore because <laughs> it's close forever but yeah it's really good i'm glad i went finally um the opera today 1932 Carl Theodore Dreyer's Vampire premiered, and uh, what a picture it is, huh? Uh, I think shot in different countries. Was it like France, Germany, and Holland, something like that? I don't know. Um, one of the best movies ever, though. I feel like this is like just like nightmare fuel. Nightmare fuel. So haunting. Um, I saw it really young and didn't know what to expect, and like it just kind of sticks with me, much like a carnival souls type thing you know like it's so simple but like so effective and what else do you need that's it we don't need anything else oh except for 1983 my sister noodles was born so happy birthday noodles because i know having a very nice day today as well so good for her so there you go the whole day from us to you till tomorrow goodbye